One of the biggest and most beloved film events for the state is happening next week. And here at ABC4, we have you covered all things Sundance Film Festival related. So today we are joined by the director of the Sundance Film Festival, Eugene Hernandez. Thank you for joining us here today. Emily, thanks for having me back. You don't have time for this, Eugene. I know you guys are like getting it all done and ready for next week already. I can't believe it's a week away. Tickets go on sale tomorrow morning oh at 10 a.m. It's here. It's exciting. You can feel it. And the it, weather arrived just in time, right? Right on cue, <laughs> you delivered. We delivered a lot of Brophy, thank you for that. <laughs> Tell us then, Eugene, how are you and everyone involved preparing for this event? Oh, well, this is a big one. It's the 40th edition of Sundance, of the festival. So for 40 years, Sundance and Utah have been in this long-term relationship of celebrating what's new in film every January. We are counting down, tickets go on sale tomorrow. We are putting the final touches on the venues here in Salt Lake, up in Park City. Um, folks are traveling in, artists are starting to arrive. We have some artists that are arriving this weekend up at the Sundance Resort for the Sundance Lab that's happening, the Writer's Lab up there. So it's all coming together, perfect storm. It is the perfect storm. So this year, as you made mention, is the 40th edition of the Sundance Film Fest. So how are you celebrating this year? And also, I, I have to believe you're probably celebrating also the decades of this festival that have come before. Yeah, I mean, for us, it's it's really special knowing that, that Sundance has this long relationship here in Utah, and it's been the home of the festival for the entire 40 years. So one of the ways we celebrate is by continuing to to discover and explore and share what's new in film. Utah audiences will get the first look at the films that everyone will be talking about a year from now. Um, but we're also gonna look back Got some classic films from the past. Napoleon Dynamite. Woo! Signature. Can That's you believe just like it? the signature of it. You all. gotta be there for that. Yes. You gotta be there for Napoleon Dynamite uh, in a couple of weeks. I mean, it's it's such a great program because we will look back at some of the, the famous films from the past mm -hmm. of the festival. But Sundance being Sundance, we look ahead. We spent the whole year exploring traveling, finding the films that we'd bring to the festival. And by the way, more submissions than ever in the history of this festival, wow. 17,000 films, features, shorts, episodic series were submitted more than ever in the history of the festival in 40 years. This is the most ever. So it made our job tough. We had to yes. winnow that down to just 90 feature films, 55 short films. Um, but we did the work and now we're ready. The festival doesn't happen until it meets the audience and that's where that's where you all come in. That's where That's all where the magic happens. happens. Yeah. So tell us, maybe you already gave us the answer to this though, but the most anticipated thing about the festival this year, is it that you had so many submissions more than ever before? Or, or what would you say? I, I think it's a big deal because you know this is a year that the industry has been challenged. There were strikes that happened this year actors, writers, directors. Um, so it's a, it's a year where we didn't know necessarily if we would see the, the groundswell of interest. We saw more films made and submitted to this festival from around the world than ever before. This is a really big deal. The, the world of filmmaking, of independent filmmaking, sets their sights on Sundance. Just like the Olympics coming to Salt Lake, right. these athletes train for years to get ready for that moment. This is the Olympics coming to the backyard of Salt Lake and Park City here in Utah. These here movies are ready for their moment, they're ready for their close up. Okay, tell us, we, our time's already up sadly uh, enough. Tell me where people can go to get tickets okay, for all of those at home who are thinking, okay, I'm sold, I wanna take part. Tomorrow morning. 9.59 a.m. Be there at 10 o'clock when the doors open. Tickets go on sale, festival.sundance.org. Okay. Tickets will be available. Films will sell out. You'll go, you'll get tickets to something else. You'll wait in line. It's You're gonna be great. It's still a part of it all. Yeah, okay. join us. Thank you so much again, Eugene Hernandez, see you there. the director of the Sundance. We will be covering, we'll have live coverage on Friday. ABC4 is going to be live from Park City. Great. We're so excited. Great. This is gonna be such a joy, and thank you for coming we and can't wait. more about it. We're excited to bring it again for the 40th time here to Utah.